Assalamualaikum and salam sejahtera. Welcome to the basic guide of consolidated drain triazial testing module. Here is the triazial frame with the load cell and the LVDT or also called as transducer. In this system, the triaxial frame can either be controlled by the computer or works in a stand-alone mode. For CU and CD testing, we need two pressure controller, one for the cell pressure and the other one for the back pressure. The pressure controller have a built-in volume change unit capability. The pressure controller can work in a stand-alone mode, but usually all of it will be hooked up to the computer via USB. Lastly, we need the data logger for the data acquisition together with the GDS Triaxial software. CD testing, single specimen, single stage testing, effective stress of 50 kPa. First of all, do ensure that the top cap is securely connected to the back pressure line. Place the wet porous disc on the pedestal. Followed by a wet filter paper on top of the porous stone. Place the soil sample onto the pedestal on top of the wet filter paper. Insert the membrane into the membrane stretcher. Fold both ends of the rubber membrane properly. Use the suction ball to suck the air trapped between the rubber membrane and the inner wall of the stretcher. Slowly lower it down until it cover up the whole soil specimen. Release the suction pressure and the rubber membrane will securely wrap tight to the soil specimen. Put away the suction ball. Roll up the top end of the rubber membrane and roll down the lower end of the rubber membrane as it grip to the pedestal. Remove the membrane stretcher. The whole rubber membrane is now securely fitted, enclosing the soil specimen. Use the O-ring tool to mount one rubber O-ring. The O-ring will be used to securely fit the lower end of the rubber membrane to the pedestal. Slide down the O-ring tool with the rubber O-ring through the specimen assemblage. Once the O-ring tool reaches the correct point, slide down the rubber O-ring as it will securely lock the lower end of the rubber membrane. Put away the O-ring tool. Precaution, make sure that the rubber O-ring locks to the pedestal and not to the soil specimen or in between the boundary of the pedestal and the soil specimen. Prepare another rubber o-ring for the top part of the assemblage. Slide down the o-ring tool with the rubber o-ring through the specimen assemblage. Carefully roll down the top end of the rubber membrane. The top section of the specimen will be exposed. Place a wet filter paper on top of the soil specimen.
followed by another wet porous stone on top of the wet filter paper. Place the top cap on top of the assemblage. Carefully curl up the back pressure line neatly curled around the assemblage. It is to avoid any obstruction during assembling the cell later on. Carefully roll up the top end of the rubber membrane. Slide the o-ring tool with the rubber o-ring upwards. Once it reaches the correct spot, slide down the rubber o-ring to release it from the o-ring tool. The rubber o-ring should be in place and clamped to the top cap of the assemblage. Put away the o-ring tool. Precaution. Make sure that the rubber o-ring locks to the top cap and not to the soil specimen or in between the boundary of the top cap and the soil specimen. Apply vacuum grease onto the base area where it connects with the bottom end of the prospect cell cover. Lock the prospect cell tightly to the base. Adjust the loading ram till it touches the top cap. Loosen the bleed valve screw at the top of the cell. For CU testing, the cell pressure valve is open in order to fill up the triaxial cell with water from the DR water tank system. The bleed valve remains open or loose during the process of filling up the triaxial cell. Please ensure the whole cell is fully filled up with water. For CU testing, the cell pressure valve is open in order to fill up the triaxial cell with the water from the DR water tank system. The bleed valve remains open or loose during the process of filling up the triaxial cell. Please ensure the whole cell is fully filled up with water. We have come to the end of the basic guide of consolidated drain triaxial testing module. Thank you very much for watching. Till we meet again, wassalam and salam hormat.